Hey, what's up guys? Welcome back. Ragnarok here with part 18 of my Kong Wrong Three Kingdoms campaign on Legendary Difficulty. We uh, find ourselves in a little bit of a pickle here. Um, we're going to try and potentially rescue this situation. Um, it's... Um, it's not good. It's not good at all. Um, obviously, the ambush here um, is... Um, it's not going to be easy to save the army. I think we'll try and save the generals. See if we can save them. Um, and not worry so much about the army. But what's even more concerning is that Kong Rong is going to be out here on his own now. And there's, um, there's another force to the south. Um, which they could potentially double team Kong Rong. Um, so yeah, we're we're in a we're in a real bad way here. This could be uh, this could really potentially derail the campaign to some extent. Um, yeah, we could be could be seeing the end of Kong Rong. This is the unfortunate thing of um, no agents and not not having any any um, agents to be able to scout. Um, it, it makes the probability of running into one of these ambushes um, a little bit higher because you're not able to uh, keep tabs on the enemy armies. Um, yeah, we had no idea. I'm surprised because we took out we took out three of Cao Cao's armies and he's got two full stacks sitting down here. One that's newly recruited and this one looks like it was newly recruited as well. If we can get everybody to over here. You guys drop your drop your siege equipment. Let's just try and escape, boys. Try and escape. Get over here. Get so it looks like this guy's going to be able to withdraw. Um we might be able to get some of these dudes out. All right, so we got one of the generals out, so that's good. But uh, I wonder what happens if I just concede to beat. Uh, what are, what are you doing? Coming back. <laughs> I uh, fuck. All right. I, I mean, the army is not as important as as getting these guys off the field. Where where are you going? Why can't you gotta withdraw over here, my man? There we go. So we save the generals. Um, I mean, obviously it does suck that the army got obliterated. But um, that's good. These guys, these have quite a bit of gear and stuff like that. Um, we might have to... Hmm, I don't know. We'll see what the situation is after this. I mean, yeah, well, we could have tried to stand and fight and, and 1,000, 2,800. Yeah, we got, wow, we got next to no kills in that 100, look at, look at the kills on these fucking guys, 175, 222. <laughs> Lost 1500, lost 31. Wow. Yeah, now the question is. Will they attack Kong Rong? Um, yeah, I, I regret splitting the army up now. Um, 
All right, let's let's move you back to here. Back as far as you can. Um, he's already in force march. I think this guy's on a force march. Um, all right, get you back into this territory so that that'll save you, and then hopefully. Hopefully they don't attack Kong Rong. Like they could, ah, uh, fuck. They don't even have to force march this guy. I don't know. I, hopefully we we can withdraw. I mean, the only other option is to disband Kong Rong and then re-recruit him. But I think um, I think now we're gonna have to um, have to regroup a little bit here. Um, but yeah, the situation with Kong Rong is uh, obviously not so good. Alright, so you guys are replenishing. And we've got uh, this dude, which looks like he's going to attack this settlement. Alright. Um, Imperial Intrigue, we're at 75. South House down to 67. I wonder if he lost Imperial Intrigue for uh, for ambushing us there. Yeah, that was really unfortunate. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not sure how it works when you're in Force March. If you can actually withdraw when you're attacked, or if you have to stand and fight. I'm not entirely sure. I'm half. Nervous to um <laughs> Yeah, they're not they're, he's not so happy with us. Um not so happy with us. God we're we're you know it's a delicate balance in this game. All of a sudden all of a sudden things are looking very, very shaky. Like our food Food situation is bad because of that event that uh, that popped up, that minus twenty food. Um, one little ambush, and we're—I um, guess I shouldn't say little. Yeah, here they come. Here they freaking come! Please tell me you can, we can withdraw. Fuck, we can't. Can't fucking withdraw. God damn it! Can we withdraw inside the battle? Oh man, we are in a bad, bad situation I have an idea though I think this may work um, it's a little bit on the cheesy side of things but um, we're gonna give it a try um, and we'll see what happens here oh shit Oh, so this dude... Okay, so the elephant... Alright. Um, good to know. Uh, the elephant, you don't actually get your bodyguard. Um, that kind of sucks. Um, it would be cool if the elephant... But we'll probably switch him off the elephant. I don't think that'll be um, particularly useful. Tower there. All right, so this is what we're going to do. We are going to concede defeat. You're about to quit this battle. Are you sure? You cannot withdraw from this battle. Conceding defeat will lose the entirety of this force. So it says, but is that actually the case? Let's see what happens here. Yeah, so this dude will get him... 
back on horseback. Try not to forget. Says we lost. 2700. Um, they lost 462. But the army has withdrawn, and it doesn't look like we've actually lost those troops. Um, so, I guess maybe it's a glitch in the matrix. We'll check it out here after the end turn. But I think Kong Rong's army has been saved, uh, believe it or not. Uh, we're still not in a great position. But um, it's much better than it would have been had we lost uh, Kong Rong's force. Yeah, suddenly we've um, we've got more enemies than we can kind of handle. I. Declaring war on South. I wish. I wish that uh, Sao do. Uh, this dude has died. Which army is this? Place uh, Zhao Du is the only one that we can replace him with. Ah, oh, that is really unfortunate. Alright, prisoner release and Shen Yang. Okay, good. Bankrupt. Alright, yeah, um, I had a feeling this might happen. Rolling boulders. The enemy have left their siege equipment vulnerable, and a well placed rock slide could grip for their assault, although we must move men away from rebuilding and repairing the fence. It can be done. Diminished reserves. Okay, that would be good. All right, yeah, do it. Siege equipment destroyed. Battering ram. All right, good, good. Death by natural causes. Sima Fang. Okay. All right. Um, the food situation actually shouldn't be too bad because this has only got two more turns left. And we should have enough supplies that we can get through the food situation. However, the uh, the fact that we're bankrupt is a little bit more pressing. All right, yeah. Um, yeah. So the reason why we're bankrupt is because um, Lady Leo here is blocking our trade, I believe. Um, yeah. See, Lady Wu trade suspended, uh, which is kind of huge. Um, making quite a bit of money from that trade. But in the meantime, let's see if we can. Uh, it. Yeah, see, army survived. Look at that. Um, said the army was going to be totally destroyed. Not the case. Not the case. All right, I think. Um, I think we're going to disband this guy's retinue. Because it's pretty beat up. Probably should disband both of these retinies. I'm going to... Uh, recall that retinie. Yeah. Um, this guy might be useful. Actually, let's... Um, this is the guy on the elephant. Let's change that back to that. Alright, so that gets us to... Full strength. Um, actually going to bring you down here to help with this battle, though. We got uh, we got this bloke headed for our farmland over here. Uh, pretty big garrison, but still, it's dangerous because of the, the heroes. The heroes would make it difficult to win that. Uh, plus, there's not a lot of quality here. 
Um, anyway, we'll see where they head, but there's nothing we can really do about that. I, I want to, um, well, I'm going to say I want to attack this army, but, um, you're a long ways off from there. Could head to there too. Yeah, they both have decent garrisons. Hmm. Yeah, we could um we could attack this army with uh Hong Rong's force and uh and this army. Um send this guy in to attack as well, but I would like to get rid of these guys. But yeah, the thing is we need, I think we need the backup, we need this force to help out. Right here. Okay. Ah, oh, Shiza. Shiza, Shiza, Shiza. He might not stand and fight, that's the thing. The feeling he's not going to uh not going to want to fight us. Actually gonna put you in there. Merge. Uh full stack there. Yeah, he did not, not want to fight us. Um, Force march you. Stay in our own territory here. Should be reinforcing right there. Heroic victory, eh? All right. Yeah, man, it's crazy how quickly this, you know, everything was going nice and smooth. And now all of a sudden the campaign is suddenly on shaky ground again. Crazy how quick, how quick that happened. Got about 5,000 of their 3,000, but they've got some pretty high quality units in here. Alright, reinforcements coming in over here. Ah, bollocks. Oh my gosh. I don't want to set up in this water. We could set up on this high ground here. Uh, actually, no, we can't set up on the high ground because... If this terrain is not to our advantage by any stretch here. The deployment area is terrible. This, uh... All right, I guess we're going to deploy over here. back here oh bollocks are you kidding me 
You might have to. You're gonna have to stay back here too. Yeah, switching him back onto the horse um, doesn't get his full. Um, His full retiny size. Alright. Turn it up. Guys back here, um just be ready to deploy to whichever side needs help. And then these guys over here try and get organized as best we can. And try and get over there to help out. Like, you guys are over there. Alright, I need you guys um, over there as quickly as possible. And then you guys move up. You guys are all on force march, so they're not going to fight the greatest. Guys are gonna be slow. Yeah, their cav is definitely gonna be problematic. Guys, shoot at them, and guys, shoot at them. Let's get over here. Yeah, the problem with I mean we could have maybe I should have set up on the on the water there, but the problem is we would probably fight like shit in the water. Fuck the cab is coming over this way now. You guys moving too slow. Get around. All right, these guys are actually doing a pretty good job on their cab over here. Um, those guys haven't yet moved. Uh, watch out for those spears. Alright, alright. Doing a pretty good job against their calf. Right. Let's get in there. What are we doing here? Mm. 
over here and help out. Alright, you guys need to do some hammer and anvil. You guys try and take out their leadership. And same thing with you. Let's get over here too. Uh, take out those cavalry first. And... You guys up here. Alright. Get moving. Ah, shit. Okay, wait, no, that's... Those spears should be able to handle them. Actually, you get in there. Those. This is a lot of infantry right here. Alright, let's uh, crash into this. Get over here. You turn around and target them. Get in there. Our, our line is starting to crumble. Our cab was just a little bit, a little bit late. Um, it's too bad we don't have these guys over here though. It would have really helped out this situation. Let's back the cab up a little bit. Back up there. And throw you back into the fight. Fuck. My artillery piece. Fuck. Need to get some get you over here too. Alright. Stamp tiger cubs are uh easy to deal with. Where have you been? I think we've almost got it, but um, getting a little bit messy. Actually, bring in there. We're starting to starting to waver. Crossbows did a really good job here. Keep running them down. We need to uh, get to try and run them down. I think this is the last unit to break over here. I think we've got it. Very scrappy fight. But uh, looks like we've got the victory. Try and finish them, wipe them all out. Um, got all the guys on this side covered. Yeah, finish them off. Guys, get to them. Alright, we got a lot of them over here to catch up to. Uh, let's see if you can catch them. I think those are our units. <laughs> 
Alright, yeah, let you guys finish them off. Um, catch them. It's just these last couple of units here. There you go. Catch them. Alright, I think we did a pretty good job here. I think we wiped out quite a few of them. Try and finish them off. Uh, but the trouble is the man, the AI gets their um, their troops in the field very quickly, very very quickly. Uh, it looks like a few of them are going to end up surviving. Yeah, we took a pounding here. Holy shit, she's down to 13. Alright, I think that should be good. Decisive victory, I will take it. Yeah, it's too bad we couldn't have used our combined forces there. I mean, it was nice to have that extra cavalry support. It really helped out a lot. Oh, <laughs> awfully violent and uh, some desperately needed uh, loot as well. Lost seven imperial favor. We will ransom for a bit of extra cash. All right, so that army is destroyed. Tell me, oh, fuck. I was really hoping. God damn, I was really hoping we could get back to our own territory without going in a force march. But yeah, we need to uh we need to get back and replenish a little bit. Um God damn, two turns. Yeah, it's such a wide frontier. It's hard to. I, I think we might come over, come back this way, and attack down that way. But um, I mean, good thing is Liu Bei is also at war with Cao Cao, so I'm hoping he gets his armies on the move down here. Um, but yeah, they've got another full stack. Down here, they're not getting replenishment though. Okay, they're in force march, that's why. Um, yeah, we've got this army to worry about. We've got 2600. I'm kind of thinking that we need to hold on to that for now, just in case we need it. Um, this army, I'm gonna get on the move. It sucks because we're gonna get shit replenishment. But we need to try and uh, try and re 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 reinforce Dong and break the siege potentially. Um, Imperial authority down to sixty-nine. Yeah, I don't think we should do any building necessarily. Oh, no, I, I think we should wait. This not terribly well defended. This territory is not terribly well defended either. But yeah, we need to... We need to get healed up. We need to replenish a bit. And... Um, figure out what we're going to do next.
Alright. I'm gonna end the turn. Thing is, I don't think Lu Bei is at war with Sao Sao's vassals, which it's it's the vassals that kind of make things dangerous for us. Oh my god. How many freaking armies does this guy have? We we've taken out four. Four of his stacks now. And he still he keeps pumping them out. I I mean I guess he's got a fair bit of wealth to work with, so we can replace the armies pretty quickly. But it is uh Yeah, it is a little bit frustrating. What's the uh what's the map here? Tell me it's a ah oh, fuck it's a field battle. Hoping that it wouldn't be a field battle. Close defeat. Oh, uh, we've got them outnumbered. But um, it's the generals that are gonna really make it difficult, and yeah, we we don't we don't exactly have quality units here. But um, kind of thinking that we might uh, might just try a corner camp and see if um, see what we can do with that. Do get actually some some deployables. Uh, corner camp definitely not gonna work over there. Oh, where's the uh, edge of the map? Is here. Mm. All right, it doesn't look like a corner camp is gonna work. Kind of use this thing to protect flank. Hmm. Ah, oh, we don't get a tower. That sucks. You there. There. Alright, we'll just do what we can here. This sucks too because we, uh, we're low on food right now. Crossbows will outrange us. But yeah, hopefully we can get a little bit of damage in on them at least. Yeah, if this was one of the settlements with... Um, one of the minor settlements where where we actually actually have towers and um, like a, a small settlement, it would have. Uh, oh, David Kolath, thank you for the subscription. <laughs> oh, that's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, if it was one of the settlements where we had actual defenses, um, I think we'd have a good chance to win here. Um, and just hold the choke points and um, whittle them down, but unfortunately. Field battle. They've got us. Uh, they've got us outmatched here. A 
wish I knew how to ignite this. I think you need... Oh, wait. Okay. Let's see. Um, maybe wait till these guys get over it. All right, let's go for it now. Oh man, they're cutting up our infantry pretty, pretty good. There's the fucking crossbows back there. Like I said, we don't have. Yeah, they've got the range on us. Problem with the crossbows. Fuck, look at this. Our units are breaking already. We'll take him out. Um, didn't actually get that just caught on fire. Yeah, see, so these units don't, <laughs> don't particularly hold for very long. These guys came back. There. Oh, where are you going? Come on. Get into that. Get over there. If you can get in behind. I feel like we're doing a little bit of damage to them, but not really. Not enough, anyway. That's for sure. I'll chase him down. And you shoot at him. Get back in there. Get in there. Uh, let's get back there. God damn it. I'm not put, I can't put you guys on guard mode. Right, get in there. At least, um, at least these guys rallied a bit. Uh, the unfortunate thing is that I'm not going to get all of our uh, all of our ammunition off with the archers it's too bad it looks like finally starting to break I'm coming back Yeah, they do. Our, our guys just keep coming back. You shoot at him. now. Yeah, I'm surprised at how um, how well they've rallied here. They they rallied quite a bit. 
It's almost over, but. Uh, just a little bit too much for us in the end. Quality here. A better quality than what we had. God, I can't believe they're still... Still rallying. But at least we did some damage to them. I wouldn't say it's a lot of damage, but we did... Uh, gotten a little bit of damage in on them here. Still, uh, still rally, fighting it out. Yeah, it's too bad we couldn't have joined the war against Cao Cao with, um, with Liu Bei. Couldn't have joined his war against Cao Cao because that would have, um, we would have avoided going to war with his vassals that way, but game is not, uh, the diplomacy is not structured that way in, uh, Three Kingdoms. Alright. Valiant effort, but, uh, in the end, a little bit too much for us. These are kills on the archers. Lost 734. Um, I mean, hopefully that's enough to prevent them from taking another farm from us. But we will have to wait and see. God damn. There's just armies everywhere now. Oh my god, another one of these fucking cunning schemes. Heard by uh, a hurried report reaches you soldiers whilst on patrol can hear the tapping beneath them. This is a sure sign that the enemy is beneath us, attempting to sap our defenses. We must deal with this immediately. Alright, smoke the tunnel. Ooh. Smoke the tunnel. Siege equipment destroyed sapping. This seems like the better... To better results. All right, yeah. So we've got some um, got enemy forces on the move. We've got Chen Yu and Zhang Chao here on the move. Uh, this force is now replenishing again. Yeah, it's a wide frontier here that we've got um, we've got to cover. We might we may have to split our forces. I don't know. What um, the best thing to do is we might come back this way and then reconquer over this way. But I think um, I think I'm gonna leave it here for now, guys, because I, I really need to sit and plan out what I'm gonna do for my uh, for my next move. Um, we we'll bring these guys over and we can sally out here. Um. 
I wish we could get him inside the settlement. Um, if we were to sally out, um, 2100. 2100 troops. How many troops do we have here? 1350. It would give us a slight advantage numerically. But I don't know about uh, quality-wise. It might be better just to let them attack us. Mm. If we go into encamp here. We gain more punishment. I don't know. It might be better just to let them attack the settlement. And um, oh, we're actually taking oh, we're taking attrition now. All right. Anyway, guys. Um, yeah, we'll probably um, probably kick things off. We'll try and take these guys on. Um, it will definitely be a tough fight. Definitely be a tough fight. Um, how much cavalry do they have? One, two, three, four, five, six. Nine cavalry, my god. That is a big cavalry. We've only got one. Oh, and these guys are not at full strength either. One, two, three. Four, five. Hmm, I don't know. I don't know. We could also recruit. We could recruit another general just to get um, more cavalry. Yeah, we could grab this guy. I might actually do that. But uh, anyway, guys, like I said, I need some time to really plan out what we're going to do next. We're in, uh, we're fighting a war on two fronts, unfortunately. And we've got a really wide frontier to defend against um, enemies that are more numerous than we are. Um, so it's um, a difficult situation, to be sure. But uh, I'm sure we'll be able to uh, work our way out of it eventually. Anyway, uh, thank you very much for watching. Have yourselves a great day. Ragnarok signing out.